Here's the kicker, Jake Elliott, ready to get this one started. And off we go from MetLife Stadium. On the return, here's Gary Brightwell. And taken down just past the 20 at about the 21-yard line. start out on the ground it's Saquon Barkley and nothing much materializing there on the first down run he'll get a couple and that's it Jones fakes the give to Barkley a quick throw there is incomplete so many things have to go right for any passing play to work out quarterback has to understand the defense deliver an accurate ball receiver has to concentrate and bring it in Somewhere along the assembly line, something was off with that one. Now Jones. Steps away to his left. And he'll protect himself at the end here as he winds up getting pretty decent yardage. Line of scrimmage with 31 now on first and 10. Throwing Jones. Finding Sterling Shepard for his puts it on the carpet. It's out. And it's picked up by the Eagles. And they have the football and will set up shop at the 33-yard line. And without a doubt, not the way they pictured that opening drive unfolding. No, they were making progress. They weren't exactly in high no, gear, no, no, no. but they, they were making a few yards along the way. And now that they've coughed it up, you gotta go back to the sidelines and regroup a little bit. And he'll follow his blockers there all the way down to the 23-yard line. And it's an Eagles first down on a gain of 11. Once again, it's Swift. And a short gain here down to the 22. Credit him with a one-yard gain there to make it second and nine. That felt like a trap because it looked to me like the opposing front was on that play from the get-go. They had everyone crash in the ball carrier before he even made the line, and they hold him to just a yard. He finds his man complete. That's Watkins. It'll go as a gain of four, and it brings up third and five now. Burt sets up to throw it. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. Got what they needed there. The drive continues with a nine-yard pickup. First and goal, a chance to convert that early turnover into points. Here's Swift. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. DeAndre Swift. A nine-yard touchdown run. And the Eagles use the early turnover to get on the board first here in this one. Sometimes you get a first and goal and you're back near the seven, eight, nine-yard line and you start thinking, maybe we'll run it here on first down to get half of what we need so maybe we can have two or three shots at going for it from closer range. So this is a bonus right here. What a great run to work his way into the end zone. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And from his end zone, here's Gary Brightwell. And he's up past the 20 to the 22-yard line. The Giants take over first and 10 at their own 22-yard line. The Giants offense at the line ready to begin their next drive. They had the fumble on the last drive, wound up leading to the opening touchdown. Now they'll try again here, first and 10. And so we're into the over. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. One play has him up past the 40 already, and another first and 10. Throwing there, but this pass is going to wind up incomplete. Oh, 
partner. Did that just happen? I've got my hand over my eyes right now because like, like him, it's going to haunt my dreams, too. He was wide Alabama, Alabama. open. How did he overthrow him there? Uh, defensively, just very lucky. You know that they got away with one there. Another throw on second down, and this one incomplete as well. He was looking that time to get it to Paris Campbell, and now it's third down. Now right where this set of downs started, they need a full 10 here to pick up the first down and move the chains. Back to throw again. That is caught, and he'll get this to the 30-yard line before crossing over out of bounds. A good pick up there, 26 yards. So from Philadelphia territory now, here's a first and 10 at the 30-yard line. Again, he'll drop to throw. Into a double team, and it's intercepted. Darius Slay with a pick. And the Eagles are going to take over at their own 13-yard line. You're looking there at a defensive back who's maybe a step slower than he was when he came into the league a decade ago. I know I question his speed coming into the game, but what he's lost in speed, he's more than made up for it with intellect. And that's a great job of knowing how to position himself to make that interception. Call it no gain on the play, and it'll be second down. Hurts. And a double coverage, and it's intercepted. And his guys will take over at the 25-yard line. So consecutive interceptions here early on in this one, and maybe setting the tone, Charles, for a game where the defense really takes center stage. And don't you think that both offenses are really catching a bit from their coaching staff about avoiding these turnovers that we've seen early? I think both teams are trying to find an advantage. We know that. Can one of them break away and take control of this game? Charles, he doesn't seem to be particularly in tune with his receivers, just two for seven throwing the football, but he did seem really locked in before the game. Yeah, and that has to do with receivers sometimes. Yes. Sometimes the defenders knock them off their routes, and you're usually pretty precise. One, two, three, cut balls out of his hands to the receiver. In this case, might be off by a half step either way. They've got to find a way to get back in sync. They get seven out of that, so they're left with a third and three. Coming up here looking for three yards to pick up the first. Jones, off play action. And to find the open man, that's complete. And he will be out of bounds here on what will turn out to be the final play of this first quarter. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. Why shift the crude? Why shift the crude? Dom Capers, Dom Capers, Dom Capers. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw to the end zone, but it's incomplete. So another incompletion there. He's hitting on fewer than half his pass attempts in this one, and that is not a winning formula. Yeah, so let's make sure we give a little bit of credit to the defense here. They've given him a lot to think about, a lot of different looks, and he seems a little bit confused trying to complete passes. So an incomplete pass a moment ago, and that leads to second and goal. They'll look to throw again. Looking end zone, but it's incomplete. All right, Captain, is batting down the hatches time defensively. Dodge two pass attempts to the end zone. Now what do you think they'll try and dial up on third and goal? Well, knowing them and knowing what we've just seen, I think they're throwing it again, don't you? I think you have to. I think in this situation, you've kind of run out of your running plays. Fire another one into the end zone. Barkley. Boy, no chance as he was met and dropped behind the line there. No movement from the field goal unit. They've got four full yards to go here on fourth and goal to hit pay dirt, but they're going to go for it. That's caught, 
It's Warner. Touchdown, Giants. Four yards on the touchdown grab. And the Giants' decision to go for it pays off with six points. Brian Dable dialing up a play call here as they will go for two. Gold cutter, gold cutter, gold. Jones throwing for it. Flushed out right. And oh, it'll be intercepted. Darius Slay with a pick. It's interesting that when it comes to two-point conversions, even heavy run teams tend to throw the ball in these situations. In this case, this one was intercepted. Yeah, they weren't fooled. They were ready for the pass, picked it off. Boy, they're down only one score, still first half, but they're going to line up for the onside kick. And the Eagles' hands team able to cover it up. A second quarter onside kick there that failed. Is that something that maybe they had dialed up before this game started? It feels like it, doesn't it? That they thought they had the right situation, you know, and, and the right approach in going after it also may signal that they feel like they have the superior team, that they can try these sorts of things and it won't come back and hurt them later. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Here's second and 10. They just do get the playoff as he'll look to throw. Got a man, it's Brown. And he is out of bounds, but not before he's inside the 30. First target, first catch, and a first down. They'll run right here with Swift. They'll take it inside the 25. Oh, that's a real nice job there by the defensive front. They just engaged and held their ground. But how about the guy who made the play? We often talk about whether they take a good first step or not. Many times, you just don't take any step. Just get your feet moving, get your body going. And then once he made the read, he was able to make the play. So after the penalty, here's second and three. Here's Hurts to throw. Dancing to his left. And he's left with no option here but to throw it away. And it's Mark play there. He's probably saying, I wish I would have done that in the last drive instead of throwing the interception. Throwing his Hurts. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. Five yards on the scramble, and that's enough to pick up the first. Two minutes remaining in this first half of football. Here's a first and 10 at the 14-yard line. A handoff, Swift running to the left. And this play gets blown up. They'll lose yardage back at the 17. That's going to wind up a loss of a full three yards on first down. After the loss, they'll come up second and 13. He'll drop to throw. Flush to his right. Hurts fumbles it. And the ball is going to wind up out of bounds. So they will lose yardage, but they'll keep the football. You can almost see inside his face mask there the look of relief. He coughed it up, but it goes out of bounds. They keep it. Someone came around with a lucky horseshoe, aren't they? If I were him, I'd go out and play the lottery after that one. A very fortunate man. And they're operating in plus territory here. They're thinking points. Definitely don't want to lose the football at this juncture. Now on 
third and long. They'll look to throw. This is caught. Touchdown. A.J. Brown, 27 yards. And they are able to add on to their advantage. Great corner route there. Not only able to catch it, turn it upfield, and get into the end zone. It usually involves a little bit of an extra move, doesn't it? You've got to get them thinking that you're moving to the middle of the field and you're breaking away to that corner. Boy, that was well executed. Elliott on for the extra point. And it's up. It's good. Our score, 14-6. to six. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And we'll see a return here from the end zone. And not a good return here at all as they'll be forced to start at the 12-yard line. At their own 12-yard line. The Giants offense at the line, ready to begin their next drive. But Charles, we'll see what they can do here. Not a ton of time left, but enough certainly to get points out of this drive. And they need them right now because they're trailing. Yeah, this is exactly why you practice a two-minute drill all through camp and at least one practice each week before a game. A minute left, more than enough time to string a few completions together, reach the end zone, and then make that walk back to the locker room just a little more animated. And a nice run past the 30-yard line there. Jones signaling, let's go, let's go, trying to get his guys up to the line. Jones now off the play fake. And this is incomplete. Oh, it looked like he had a pretty good line on that one. That would have been a big play, but he could not pull it in. If I'm making excuses, and I am. Sometimes the sun can be difficult on a ball like that. That looked like it was going to be right there, but it's in and out of his hand. And a potential big play goes by the wayside. And they will bottle him up behind the line, and now will they use a timeout? The Eagles going to take the first of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 24 seconds to go in this first half. Okay, here we go. This offense converted once on fourth down earlier. Now they're out there again to try once more. They'll try and throw for it here. Buying time to his left. Boy, a curious decision to go for it. Doesn't pan out. And the Eagles are going to take over in great field position. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. Now Hurts going to shift him around a bit. They'll come out throwing here on first down. And this is caught. Touchdown, Philadelphia. DeAndre Swift. Like, I've been smooth for so long, I'm trying to get rough.